Hello, and welcome to this healthcare training brought to you by SEIU Healthcare PA and the Training and Education Fund. Today's topic, we will explain the use of personal protective equipment in healthcare settings. We use PPE in healthcare settings to improve personal safety in the healthcare environment. We will cover information on the selection and use of PPE in healthcare settings and teach you how to safely don and doff PPE. PPE is specialized clothing or equipment worn by an employee for protection against infectious materials. Employers must provide appropriate PPE for employees. Ensure that PPE is disposed, or if reusable, PPE is cleaned, laundered, repaired, and stored after use. The CDC recommends when, what, and how to use PPE. Gloves must be worn every time you touch blood, bodily fluids, broken skin, and provide patient care. Work from clean to dirty, reduce touch contamination, protect yourself, others, and the environment, don't touch your face or adjust PPE with contaminated gloves. Don't touch environmental surfaces except as necessary during patient care. Be sure to change gloves if torn and when heavily soiled, even during use on the same patient and after each patient. Discard in the appropriate receptacle. Never wash or reuse disposable gloves. Gowns protect your exposed skin. They also prevent soiling of your clothing. Gowns should fully cover your torso. They should fit comfortably over your body and have long sleeves that fit snugly at the wrist. A mask should be worn when caring for clients with respiratory illnesses. They should fit snugly over your nose and mouth. Goggles provide protection for your eyes. Eyeglasses alone do not provide proper eye protection. Goggles should fit snugly over and around your eyes. Face shields protect the face, nose, mouth, and eyes. They should cover your forehead, extend below the chin, and wrap around the side of the face. Let's talk about how to safely don, use, and remove PPE. Key points about PPE, don before contact with the patient and entering the room, use carefully don't spread contamination. Remove and discard carefully at the doorway and immediately perform hand hygiene. Here's the sequence for donning PPE. Gown first, mask or respirator, goggles or face shield, and then your gloves. Here's how to don a gown in four easy steps. Let's learn how to don a mask. How to don eye and face protection in three easy steps. Lastly, don gloves. Be sure to have the correct size and type. Insert your hands and extend the gloves over the isolation gown cuff. Removing PPE should be done at the door before leaving the patient's room. This process follows a specific procedure. Contaminated areas of PPE are located on the outside or the front and have been in contact with infectious materials. Clean areas of PPE are the inside, outside back, ties on the head and back, and have likely not been infected. First, remove your gloves. Second, remove your face shield or goggles. Third, remove your gown. Fourth, remove your mask or respirator. Remove PPE at the doorway before leaving patient room or in the anteroom. Remove respirator outside the room after the door has been closed. Grasp outside edge near the wrist. Peel away from the hand, turning the glove inside out. Hold in opposite gloved hand. 
slide ungloved finger under the wrist of the remaining glove. Peel off from inside, creating a bag for both gloves and discard. After you remove your gloves, immediately perform hand hygiene. To remove your face shield or goggles, grasp ear or head pieces with ungloved hands. Lift away from face and place in a designated receptacle for disposal. Immediately perform hand hygiene. Next, remove your isolation gown. Unfasten ties, peel gown away from neck and shoulder, turn contaminated outside toward the inside, fold or roll into a bundle and discard. Immediately perform hand hygiene. To remove your mask, lift the bottom band first, then the top, remove from the face and discard. Immediately perform hand hygiene after removing PPE. Wet your hands with clean, warm water and apply soap. Lather and rub your hands together for at least 20 seconds then rinse hands well under clean running water. This concludes our video on PPE use in healthcare settings. Thank you for watching.